Hi, welcome to Roger George Reynolds. We're excited about a new product that we have. It's called a steric acid gun. It's what we use to make non-pyrotechnic body hits, head hits, shoulder hits, hand hits, anything. This is non-violent way to do it and it works great. My name is Albert Lanuti. I've been doing special effects 43 years. I'm a number one powder card and uh, we're excited about this. So we're gonna show you how to do this. Uh, we have kits made up. We, uh, we're excited to show you this. So let me show you how to do this. Okay, we are got a steric acid mold with an adjustable shaft, which goes, you loosen the, the wing bolt and you can adjust the size of your head. Comes with steric acid, a four ounce can. This will last you, you can reuse it and reuse it. It'll last you forever. Comes with two ounces of Roger George blood with an eyedropper. Comes with three razors. That's the scrape. I'll show you that. A spoon and a steric acid gun. Okay. The first thing we do, the first process we do is adjust how deep we're gonna be, which I got. Got a spoon, oh, you don't need much. You need about a tablespoon. Although the spoons are, that I got in the kit are uh, tablespoons, you only need half the amount. When you heat this, heat this from underneath, because if you shoot it this way, it's gonna spatter and catch it. I'm melting the steric acid. Melted. Pour into the mold. Get it in the center there. Fill it up, count to 12. 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 5,000, 6,000. 8,000, 9,000, 10,000, 11,000, 12,000. Pour out the excess stearic acid into the spoon. What you have now is a shell. You wait for it to dry, cool off, get your razor blade. Shouldn't take more than 30 seconds at the most. Scrape it off. So you're flush again. You still have that shell in there. You still have that capsule. Scrape off the excess. And this is reusable. So take this and get yourself a little pile because it's still reusable. Now we're going to apply blood into the shell. Got an eyedropper. Could be anywhere from three to four drops, depending how big your head is, to nine or ten. Don't fill it to the top because you still have to make a steric acid cap. Okay. Take the remaining that's still hot, steric acid. Cap it off. Wait for it to dry. This takes about a minute to a minute and a half. While you're letting that dry, just pick up your excess stearic acid, scrape it. It's all reusable. Just put it back in the jar so you can use it again. So, all right. Again, you take the razor and you flush this, you flush this piece. Flush, mount, because you need to go into the steric acid gun. Apply pressure to push it out. There is the capsule. When you're taking this capsule off, Hit it to the side, don't pinch it, because you have the tendency to break it. Just push it to the side. All right, a little blood, take off the, 
Now, a mouthpiece, the mouthpiece is smaller than the orifice on here. Okay, it is now loaded. Right now, you know, sometimes when you first start out with this, you're gonna be clumsy in making these uh, steric acid hits, but just keep practicing, they will work. They work great. All right, let's go ahead and see what this does. We do this for little productions and uh, three cards. This is a non-pyrotechnical body hit. All right, I'm gonna shoot this man in the chest. You wanna be as close as you can get to this guy. Wherever camera is at, you gotta be as close.